The Dance Theatre of Harlem was founded in 1969 with a message of empowerment through the arts for all. The company uses the language of ballet to celebrate African-American culture, and these amazing dancers are bringing their talents to the Newman Center at the University of Denver this weekend. Joining me now is Aisha Ahmed Post, the executive director of the Robert and Judy Newman Center. Thanks so much for joining us. We appreciate it. Well, thank you so much for having me. So the Dance Theater of Harlem has such a rich and important history. What do you want people to know about this ballet company? Sure. You know, I think Dance Theater of Harlem is one of the most acclaimed companies in America, uh, one of the greatest companies. They've been around for over 50 years. They were supposed to be here for their 50th anniversary season, but then, of course, COVID-19 got in the way. Um, so this has been a highly anticipated event, one of the biggest uh parts of our dance calendar of the year. So I'm really excited to finally have them here uh, this coming weekend. You know, for some people, actually a lot of people, their only knowledge of ballet might be something, you know, kind of mainstream like the Nutcracker. What would your message to someone be to convince them to come out and see this company? Sure. I think, uh, you know, a lot of people, as you mentioned, think of, you know, story ballets like Cinderella or Snow White, something like that. Um, and it's really, dance is such an incredibly diverse and vibrant way of communicating uh, about the world and about somebody's experience. So the performance this coming weekend really draws on a wide variety of disciplines and cultural experiences from all over the world, really. Uh, Dance Theater of Harlem engages choreographers from all over the world, uh, from different cultures and languages. Um, and so the, the work actually really speaks to that. It's not ballet like you're thinking of. Uh, it's really a contemporary type of ballet. Um, and it draws from traditions uh, and thoughts and viewpoints that have not normally been centered in the ballet world. It really helps you to think beyond what you might normally expect from a ballet company. I think that's really the most exciting part of it. Watching some of this video right here, I mean, it, it's just an art. You gotta be athletic to do this too. It's amazing. Yes, the ballet, uh, this is a professional ballet company, right? So these folks have been training since they were, you know, three or four years old. Um, and it's extraordinarily competitive. Uh, and it is, you know, it takes hours and hours of training and preparation a day. Um, they're, they're in the studio for upwards of six to eight hours a day working on their craft. So it's a highly physically demanding um, and really specialized discipline. Very cool. Okay, so what do people need to do to get tickets? And then what kind of safety uh, COVID precautions are in place at the Newman Center? Absolutely. COVID-19 uh, and the safety of our patrons are at the very top of our mind. Um, so we do require proof of vaccination to attend. Uh, and we do require masks be worn at all times while in the building. Uh, so you can get tickets at newmancenterpresents.com. I do have to warn you that uh, tickets are selling really fast um, and it's on, on its way to selling out. Um, but if you're interested, please join us. You can call our box office at 303-871-7720 or go to newmancenterpresents.com to grab your tickets, but do it, do it today. Okay, act quick if you want to go. Uh, before I let you go, anything else I'm, I'm forgetting or you want audiences to know? Um, I think it's just really exciting to have uh, the preeminent uh, black dance company in America coming to Denver. We do have a local Denver native, Carlia Shelton Benjamin, who was one of the original company members, and she'll be joining us for a pre-show talk on Friday at 6.30 p.m. So join us for that, too. Cool. Vocal connection. That's awesome. Aisha, thanks so much for joining us. We appreciate your time. Thank you so much for having me. All right. And anyone interested, we'll put a link to get tickets on our website, cbsdenver.com.